Hi, I'm Bucks County District Attorney Matt Weintraub, and I'm here with uh, Kevin Travers, who's a teacher at Truman High School. Uh, actually, at Armstrong Middle School. Ah, I stand corrected, but <laughs> the reason that we're here, Kevin, is because you are responsible for a 20-year legacy here at, at the high school and throughout the Bristol Township School District, correct? That is correct. And that's called Drummers with Attitude. Drummers with Attitude. We're a bucket drumming group uh, that comprises of students in middle school and high school, both middle schools, the tech school and the high school. Um, all exceptionalities and all ethnicities are welcome. So the way I understand it is there's really no qualification other than a desire to do something good and pro-social after school. Absolutely. Uh, as long as kids are respectful and try their best, uh, we'll accept everyone into the program. There are no exclusions. Um, but we emphasize that they try their best in school and in the program and, of course, respect all around. And I understand that we may be hearing from a couple of the drummers who have quite a legacy here. Oh, yeah, yeah. In fact, one in particular, uh, both her older brothers went through the program and her younger brother is now in the program. And there's uh, another future younger brother who will be going through the program as well. Uh, one of her older brothers is in Drexel University right now. And the other one graduated from Walnut restaurant school down in Philadelphia. That's excellent. And I take it that the point is if we give kids a pro-social activity to do after school, they're not going to get into trouble because they have somewhere to be and something to focus their passions on? Absolutely. Um, you know, the point of this program, one of the many goals is to uh, reach out to students, uh, kind of create a family atmosphere away from home. Students realize, you know, that they are not alone that they have opportunities and people they can reach out to and give them something to do uh, where it includes everybody. Again, that's what I'm most proud about this program is that it includes everybody. Kids can help each other uh, and they really do create that bond within the program, which if you've ever come out to any of our shows, you'll see it's quite uh, evident. I have seen you all perform a couple of occasions. I think the first one was a parade mm -hmm. and very recently at the Squaring Inn up at the Justice Center. Uh, and the, just the, the energy, it makes you feel like you could do anything. You want to run through a wall after you hear these kids play. Oh, that's right. You know, uh, you know, having that vibe and being able to give that back to the students and the community is what it's all about. I mean, that's why we're teachers. That's why we do what we do. And uh, to have a program that's able to, you know, reach kids throughout the entire spectrum of people uh, is, is just an honor and uh, something that I'm most proud of. And as you were telling me earlier, if people want to engage Drummers with Attitude, they can contact you by email, correct? Correct. As long as they're a resident of Bristol Township uh, and attend school here or live in the district, um, they can reach me at dwatravers at gmail.com. It's really amazing. This is all about having a pro-social option after school that anybody can do and you've really worked wonders. So this has been Matt Weintraub along with Kevin Travers, who has been representing Drummers with Attitude for 20 years and counting. Excellent, thank you very much. Hey, thank you. Thanks for coming. My pleasure. Thank you. I love that feel. I love how you can feel the drums yeah. in your body. When, it's when, like once you start, you just like you can't stop. Yeah, it just it just keeps going. But that hour goes quick, huh? Mm -hmm. When did you first join? I first joined when I was in sixth grade, so two years ago. But I got into it when I was in like fourth grade because my brothers played. Yeah. So like when they called out for volunteers, I would go in and I would play. Ah. And it just like I was like I want to do this too. So your brothers really created kind of a legacy for you. Yeah, they. It was like. They were so happy, and I wanted to do that, too. Yeah, they, so they were bringing that home with them, huh? Yeah. You know what I love about it? So many things, but it's if you're doing this, you're safe, you're in a great environment, and you're not doing any knuckleheaded stuff out there on the streets, right? Yeah. Trav's goal is for us to get out of like all that stuff and for us to be happy and for us to be involved in the program outside of school. So far, so good. Yeah. You've been doing this now. This is your third year? Well, Sixth, seventh, eighth. Yeah, that's my. It's yeah. my third year. Yeah, and some. I understand some of these kids have even graduated high school already. Mm -hmm. Cause my brothers, when they like come home from school, they'll come in sometimes and they'll play with us, and it's fun having people come back and playing.
because they'll come back and they'll play. They'll still remember the beats. Does everybody like to get ready for the shows? Yeah, we yeah. love getting ready for the shows, and it's he makes us enjoy it. And he's like, "You guys ready? You guys ready?" It's like, "Yeah." And no stage fright, Ashley? No, not anymore. When nah. I was in sixth grade, the beginning, I was like, kind of scary, but now it's just like, it's it's family. Yeah, yeah, and you, you know, you have something so great to share with people. Mm -hmm that there's nothing to be nervous about. Well, I look at it like it's the gift that keeps on giving, not only to you all, but you all giving to your community. And when you can give back to your community and get something great out of it yourselves, that's a win-win situation. Yeah, because it's like, whether you call it DWA, Drummers with Attitude, or just Bucket Drumming, it's all, to me, it's just all family. So it doesn't really matter which one you want to call it. It's just family. Well, that's wonderful. So we've been here, uh, this is, Ashley Bottrell, she goes to Armstrong, yes. and you're in eighth grade, and she certainly is a drummer with an attitude, <laughs> but comes from a long legacy of family members who have been in the organization, yes. and hopefully more to come. Yes. Thanks, Ashley. Thank you. Uh-huh. Or Travers, you said Travers. Uh-huh. Uh, what, what grade did you start in Drummers with Attitude? Um, tenth grade. Tenth grade? Mm-hmm. Uh, so do you love it? Yeah, I love it. What do you love the best about it? Love, play drums, like all stuff I play, all these drums, play bucket, play drums. Would you recommend to other people to join Drummers with Attitude? Yes. And, and if anybody wants to hear Drummers with Attitude, can they come hear you play? Yes. Excellent. Thanks for being with us, Lucas. This has been Matt Weintraub, Bucks County District Attorney, here with Lucas Balthasar and Drummers with Attitude at Truman High School. Be safe.